what you're great at and do it over and over again. Do it right. There's buzz in the air. All you gotta do is go perform well and play really, really hard. Let's go get it. Oh, Together, one, two, three. Yeah. Here we go. Welcome to Robert A. Arnson Gymnasium at Delphus St. John's High School for Saturday night Delphus High School basketball. Certainly excitement in the air with these local geographic rivals. The Van Wert Cougars are in town. Okay, oh, makes a move to the free throw line. Stops and hits a 15-foot jumper and puts his team on the board first. Two nothing Blue Jays. There he is with 15-foot jumper, and he gets it to go, so Keaton Welch ties it up. We're a minute in, it's 2-2. Cam Elward takes his first three of the season, and he gets it to go as he's two for two. He's being guarded by Colin Feathers. Colin doing a nice job of putting pressure on him, goes after the ball. Tice McClain comes up with the loose ball, goes right to the basket and lays it in. Blue Jays lead up to 10, 14 to 4. Dribbles with his left hand back to his right, throws it to Schrader on the give and go, and Joel Schrader goes and lays it in, and it's 18 to 6. Totally at the other end of the floor, and another rebound comes off to the Blue Jays. And Munder's going to put up the three. He gets it. And now the Blue Jays are running away from things. Nice rebound by Campbell down low. He puts it back up and gets it to go. 27-11. But he misses the shot. Can't get it to go. Cam Elwer pulls it down. Goes right to the bucket. Puts it up and in. But Colin Feathers pulls down the offensive rebound. Andrew Elwer makes a nice move, gets past his man, gets to the basket for a layup. That was pretty. Throw it in. inside to Campbell, and he gets right to the basket and lays it in. Through the ball after the Cougars come up with it, and a three is up and good by Griff McCracken. Here come the Cougars. They trail by 17, and not even looking is Campbell, and Austin Munner takes it away, goes right to the basket, and lays it in. It's 46-27 Blue Jays. Keaton Welch able to get past Munter all the way to the basket. Three on the way by Andrew Elward. Here's Austin Munner for three, and boy, they've got a few three shooters on this team, don't they? We're inside of five minutes left in the third quarter now. Here's Campbell making a move, puts it up with his left hand. Nice finish. Colin Feathers grabs the rebound, gives it up to Andrew, and they throw it up the floor. Tice McLean's going to put a three up and gets it. Gage Steeman, he tries to throw it to Welch underneath, and it's going to lead to a breakaway layup for Cam Elward. There's Cam Elwer with a nice backdoor pass by Joel Schrader. Here's a move to the basket by Connor Campbell, and he puts a little floater in, make it 59-36. Here's Connor Campbell, makes a nice move to the free throw line, puts up a jumper, won't go. Nice rebound, Joel Schrader. Nice pass by Cam down low to Joel Schrader. Cam goes right by everybody and lays it in. Aaron drives inside, stops at about eight feet, makes a nice feed to Drew Boggs. They look for that backdoor play, but Grant Holmes steals it away. Colin Feathers, he hits another three. A move to the basket, nice pass down low. And at the other end of the floor, Tice McLean lays it in with his left hand again. Three on the way, won't go, rebound comes down to Klaus. He dribbles it up the floor, stops at the free throw line, makes a nice pass down low to Prager, and the Jays go to 1-0 on the season. The Cougars fall to 0-2.